Pan, you've brought this village one step closer to another wonderful lumberjack. Thanks, but Farmer Abernathy's carrot field was destroyed when I got there. What? Oh, this will raise my spirits. Ben, meet the Grashugal Lumberjack team. Hello, Ben. Is everything set up for the festival then? Well, we've had some trouble getting the big logs out of the lumber yard. Yeah, we're stumped. I'm sure Ben here could handle it. Uh, can't you, Ben? Well, hanging out with lumberjacks does sound fun. Meet us at the lumber yard when you're ready. Okay. This will come in handy. subir, vamos lá. Hey there. Ok, aqui vou precisar de four arms. Don't 
expect any less. coming. we need to do is get these logs out of the lumber yard so they can be hauled to the festival site. I'll take a swing at it.
Okay. Nice job. We knew there was a reason Stefan recommended you. You can chop that up as a success. Ha! <laughs> You're all right, kid. Want to come practice chopping with us before the festival? You don't have to ax me twice. That sounds like a blast. Great. Come meet us in the woods when you want to start. Look out! Marked some trees for you. Let's see what you've got. Jack Ben, we found this massive tree, and we thought we'd give you the honor of chopping it. Going in and taking everything with me. My <laughs> Take 
revenge when you try to chop him down? Not like that. Good thing you were here, Ben. I hate to admit it, but we were quivering like saplings. Don't worry about it. I should probably check in with Gwen. Hey, Gwen. What's up? Hey, Ben. How's it going? I got to hang out with Lumberjacks. But I also found a magical tree that spawned void monsters when I tried to chop it down. Huh. I wonder if that's one of the power springs the tablet mentions. There are three locations, and it says they'll all be in normal places no one would suspect. A tree in the forest fits that description. You're right. I'd better go call the mayor. Bye, Ben. Oh, and bring me a souvenir from... Care of the trees, but now I have to tell you about the magical monsters around town. One of our lumberjacks just stopped by to tell us what happened in the forest. I'm sure that sneaky sorcerer Hex had something to do with this. Yes, well, I've asked Dr. Fibian to help investigate what could have caused such a. Up ahead. Thank you. 